Government will debate the Property Tax Amendment Bill 2024 in the Parliament next Monday with the aim of reducing the rate of residential property tax from 3% to 2%. Finance Minister Carl Mimbert said the decision came after several teething issues, including several cases of feedback where residential landowners and occupiers in close proximity have complained about discrepancies in annual rental values that appear illogical to them, as well as expectations of the outdated annual rental values. To correct this, he said an order will soon be published extending the time period for persons to bring objections to notices of valuations from 30 days to six months. The intention here is clear. The government intends to be transparent with respect to the valuations that have been sent to residential landowners and occupiers by the Commission of Valuations and will give owners and occupiers additional time to lodge objections. To date, he said 801 persons have made payments of property taxes amounting to just over TT $1 million and it shows that corrective action will be taken to adjust to the new rate. All of these taxpayers will be issued with new tax notices at the new rate of 2% and refunded and I've asked the BIR to do so promptly. With the bill now before the Parliament, Minister Inbert said he has requested that the Board of Inland Revenue, BIR, cease the collection of property tax until the new rate of residential property tax is in effect. But he said notices which were posted at some regional revenue collection offices on Thursday indicating the suspension of payments for property tax were not authorised by the Ministry of Finance. That some of the staff in the Board of Inland Revenue, after becoming aware of the provisions in the amendment bill, took it upon themselves to do this with apparent good intentions, but without authorization and without my knowledge or consent. This is not the way that a cabinet decision should be communicated to the public, especially on a matter as sensitive as this. In addition to adjusting the rate, Minister Inbert said the bill is also expected to extend the time for the Board of Inland Revenue to issue notices of assessment up to June 30th, 2024. Sonolala, TTT News.